since arriving in South Australia, I've been bowled over by its intense passion for classical music and, yep, you got the clue, cricket. And I am here in one of the most iconic cricketing venues in the world, the Adelaide Oval. And you know, for me, it's a bit of a schoolboy dream come true. And what a wonderful mix of the old and the new this ground is. Do you see behind me there, that scoreboard is over a hundred years old and it's still manually operated. Well, hi Greta. Hi John. Now you have a very famous surname. Yes, a lot of people do recognise it. <laughs> <laughs> you share it with that man there. You are Sir Donald Bradman's granddaughter. You're am, also yeah. an internationally renowned operatic soprano. So we're about to combine two real passions, classical music and cricket. He was really passionate about both of those things. So I was thinking we could go into the Bradman collection and have a little bit of a look at how he lived. Absolutely, let's go. Okay. You know, John, one of the amazing things about coming here for me is there are obviously a lot of objects behind glass now, but for me, so many of them remind me of my childhood. I used to play with some of them. This bat, for instance, I remember playing backyard cricket with my grandpa and uh, my little brother, Tom. And now and it's in a museum. <laughs> it behind glass. Now, this is one thing that really interests me. This is the record player, the kind of record player that he had. Yes. He loved music. Tell me a little bit about that passion for music. He loved his music, particularly um, symphonic works. Would it be right to say your grandpa, Sir Donald, I can't call him, uh, first introduced you to classical music? Yeah. Before bed, I would sit with grandpa at the record player and we would listen to classical music together. And I think from that, uh, I grew this passion for for, for singing and for, for music. Give me a little taste of that voice now, a, a song maybe that you knew through your granddad, through your grandpa. Will you give me a little song? Yeah. I might um, sing one of the first songs I ever remember hearing and it was actually my grandpa singing to me. He used to sing this song for you and now you're going to sing it for us. What is it called? Amazing Grace. Go on then, Greta. <clears throat> blind but now I see 